So on today's video, I'm going to be, I've had this problem with the brake carrier and uh, we're going to be removing the caliper and the brake pad carrier um, so that I can try and clean it off because I've had a problem with the brakes. Uh, so it just looks like it is. 213mm bolt top, hopefully. Hopefully it just comes off. Oops. I think I did it. Oh yeah, and then this one. Just be a question of yeah, it's heavy. I don't know if you can see that. This car is from 2000, it's heavily rusted. And I haven't looked after it. I'm gonna do is take it off and clean it up. I think, uh, uh, oh yeah, I'm wearing the gloves and um, oh, yeah, safety notice. The brake dust is toxic so. If you're doing any work on the uh, um, brakes, you're supposed to wear a mask so you don't breathe any of the crap in, don't breathe any of the dust in. Probably applies, if, if you've got a mask, it's probably better to wear that when you're doing stuff like this as well because there's a lot of, there's a lot of dust coming off the rust and also there might be uh, brake dust, you know, that's in the area because there's, there's stuff coming off there. That might have just be rough, but it's probably uh, worth wearing a mask and the gloves so you don't get it in your hands and try and, uh, um, what do you call it, not to kick up too much of it, put like some newspapers down on the ground as well first. Um, but I think that it should be coming off. The caliper, here's the caliper. Well, I'm doing that, change the caliper. See, I've got a lot of, there's a lot of rust and everything on that, and even on the inside of the pot. It's sealed it, I think. It's got a lot of rust, I might have to take that off. I'm gonna need to clean it off in place. Or, I don't know if I can take the brake hose off and put an end cap on it or something just so that I could quickly put an end cap on it so I don't have to drain down all the whole brakes and see whether I can do that maybe there's something on eBay or uh, Amazon you can just screw onto the end of the brake hose so that you don't have to take the whole thing to bit so you don't have to drain the whole lot down so that, that's coming out uh, that's coming out. Uh, a bit more. Uh, uh, yeah, that looks like it may have. Yeah, brilliant. That's cool. So that's enough. Oh, I mean, I might have to scrap this car soon because it's just. It's so. Oh, yeah, there's a bit of. I think might take the disc off and clean that off as well while I'm doing this. It's all rusted. I mean, all the work that I did, if you watched my previous videos, the work I did on the gears, that looks all right, because it's in gear now, but it, it's not, it's not, um, that is moving freely. Although it's in, if I take it out of gear in the next video, you see that that is okay. It was just the brake, the brake pads got jammed onto the, Jammed onto it, and it was boiling hot to spray water onto it. Uh, but anyway, um, so this, this what I do now is I'll clean that off and then I'll put it back. Um, take the disc off actually, and then I'll do another video. So uh, thanks for watching and.
please tune in for the next video when I'll be, yeah, I'll be coming and cleaning all this off. This doesn't help me having good breaks. I need to clean that off. Maybe I could paint, finish off painting the yellow. The pot. I put some gear rust on the pot as well. That's all bad. So I think the seals are right. Uh, please tune in for the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.